What's up guys, Waddle Gaming here, and welcome back to more Assassin's Creed Origins. Today we're taking out the hyena. I've made it up to her lair that is right behind me. So we're taking out the hyena, getting her out of the way, and then we should be able to explore Giza, namely the three pyramids that you see in front of me. However, before we do that, let's head up here and see if she's home, which I'm guessing she's not going to be, but sure, why not? Whoa. And she is up there. And would you believe it, there is hy there are hyenas here. You know, just to fill in the fact that she's known as the hyena. Whoa. And promptly enough, it's a hyena lair. Well, sure, I'm in need of soft leather, and I'm sure she won't mind if I, uh, slay her brethren. Hi! Can I take your, uh, I need your soft leather, so I'm gonna need you all to die. No, come on! There we go. I just need you to die, and there we go. All the soft letter in the world. And... Wait, what? I haven't taken out the alpha. Hold up. You mean to tell me in that entire gang of hyenas... I don't even know what hyena packs are called, but... Are you telling me I didn't take out the alpha? The alpha is up... How'd the Alpha get up there? I'm actually really confused at the moment. Okay, the Hyena Alpha is up here. Does that mean that the Hyena is home? So this is the Hyena's lair. No sign of Khaliset though. Yeah, I kind of guess that. Red was telling the truth. Yeah, I need to figure out where she went. I kind of guess that she wouldn't be home. Help! Help me! Oh, dude, shut up. I'll get to you in a minute. I've got hyenas to kill. I do not want to die! Dude, calm down. Do not! Do not let her take me! She's not here, man. Now, why would one of her loyal beasts be caged? Yeah, that's strange. I do not want to die! Oh my god, I'm getting real sick of this dude. Please! Get me out! Shut up! Mercy! Thank you, Magi! The hyena, where is she? I do not know. I am... I'm the only one left. She took the others away hours ago. Took them where? She kills them! I know it! She... She... Her hands! Oh, God! Her hands are so bloody! Peace, friend. You are free. I will deal with Haliset. Calm your damn... Where is Haliset taking captives? And Calm why? your damn tits, buddy, and stop screaming. Good Lord, you didn't have to scream that much. Now, why was one of her... people caged? Kufu's tomb. She has detailed every crevice. Ah, she has not finished. That is where I will find her. I will head to the pyramids. A drawing of the Great Pyramid, pyramid of Kufu, most likely made by the hyena. She seems to have drawn attention to something beneath the tomb. I get to go into a pyramid? Okay, I'm liking where this is going. I kind of guessed I'd have to go under the Sphinx because there is a small little area you can explore, but no, it's one of the pyramids. Okay, which pyramid is it? Because there is three of them. Let me just get into a good position. By the looks of it, it is the giant one on the left. I think that's the one that has the synchronization point on top. 
Okay. I was actually thinking, yeah, that it was going to be the Sphinx, but no, apparently it's the Pyramids. So, sure, why not? I said we were going to go explore the Pyramids. Uh, turns out I'm going to be exploring one of them one part early, so... You know what? I will take it. It also seems a little bit creepy that, yeah, she can control hyenas. So, I'm taking it she's some form of master hunter? Someone that can control animals? Or something like that? My god, these things are big. Yeah, this is the one that has the sink point on top. I might actually leave that for now. If we end up killing her in here, then I will climb on top. And, uh, we'll see what the view looks like from up there. For now, however... Wait, am I not going in the other route, or am I finding a different way in? This might actually be a separate location. And would you guess there's Whoa. more hyenas? Hyenas. Haliseth must be inside. Right, are you little shits? Your master is going to die. So, you know. I will take all your leather. Here we go. The tomb of Khufu. You! Who dares to enter here where silence has befallen her? A Magi who has treaded many dunes to find you. Hide if you must, Hyena. But this tomb will not protect you. I demand that you stop here. Turn back now and I will excuse this intrusion. Siwa was an intrusion. Okay. So there was a crack back there we could have gone into. And this thing is literally a maze. Okay, I feel like we're going to run into some issues really quickly here. What's up here? Is there anything up here? There are some bowls. Let's quickly just light these up. It might help us later. Thank you, Bayek. I have no idea where I'm going. It looks like there's three different ways to get inside this pyramid, so... Hopefully this is where I'm supposed to be going. I am not even going to attempt to read that, by the way. Pause it if you want to read it. Um, where are some more bowls so I can light this place up? Ah, this looks like a secret entrance. Oh, wow. Okay, so we've found hidden treasures. Break all the seals connected to a sealed door to open it. Okay, that's kind of cool. And... The unwary who unleashed the desert sands will be swallowed into the arid depths. I have a feeling that this is a trap. But we haven't seen a tomb like this since the start of the game. O King, you are this great star, the companion of Orion who traverses the sky with Orion. Who navigates the Duat with Osiris, you ascend from the east of the sky, being renewed at your due season. Okay, I have no idea what that means. We've also found a stone tablet. Ancient writing from the Old Kingdom. There's a free skill point right there. 
and also some loot. One carbon crystal. What else have we got? Give me something good. A regular sword. Son of Senuf Sefuru? Geez, some of these names. Just not even gonna try to pronounce. Actually, Bayek, thank you. I must be getting towards the end of something because I just... There's daylight. Now, if none of you are kidding about how dark it is in this game, let me just throw this away for a second. Just look at that. That is pitch black. I can't see anything. I don't even know if it's pitch black even if you turn your brightness settings up. I would like to check, but I'd rather not mess with them. I feel like I've went the wrong way. I feel like I've just explored this place and not actually done anything useful. And there is a crack. Actually, no, that's not a smaller crack. And what the hell? Okay, I've officially come out the wrong way. Well, this is kind of embarrassing. And I'm also on the opposite side of the pyramid. Okay. I, uh, I might need to go back around and back in the other way again. So, what we must have done is I must have gone in the regular way that you go in. So, there's two small separate ways I can go through this place. So, I'm guessing, let's try this crack. Yeah, here we go. That, I didn't like that. Or did I? I'm assuming I haven't, but... Yeah, there's no way I lit these. This is the right way towards the hyena. Or at least I hope so. Foolish man, I am Iset, possessor of magic. The gods live here, not you. What sort of mischief is she entertaining? Oh, I don't know, Bayek. Sir Ket, there's a lot of, you know, a lot of gods. Where the hell am I going? Be gone! Osiris cannot be disturbed. Hyena. This trap door. What is it protecting? Heathen! The wakeful one is asleep! Go no further, or I will drench these arid plains with your blood! What is this place? A tomb beneath a tomb. What the living hell is down here? Is this where you hide, hyena? What the living hell is this place? <laughs> okay, you've officially piqued my curiosity here. What gruesome madness happened here? A dark place with a window to the gods. What kind of ritual is she performing? What the hell is going on here? Still warm. And the ceremonial knife. This was a sacrifice. Why have I gone from killing one target to looking like I'm inside the Animus right now? Offerings to Osiris, protector of the dead. Okay. And this sarcophagus is decorated with goddesses of the mother. Strange symbols are marked all over it. Okay then, what the living hell is this? Retransmission, segment three. Acquiring contemporaneity. It has been 95 days since the Great Catastrophe. The Messenger speaks. You must be wondering why I have reached out to you. It was written, you see, that you would come to this particular chamber at this very moment in time. The walls told us of your coming when we once were. Look at them. Are they not fascinating? 
in the fear. Walk the fear. I don't read gibberish. These walls tell of a tragic story. A story we transcribed on our structures, on our artifacts. A story we cannot alter. A mystery defying us in plain sight. We tried. Our scholars and scientists, poets and physicists, bright minds, rebellious hearts. They all tried so hard to bring about change. They, we all failed. None could change what we discovered, the stories written into the walls of these rooms. By whom, we never knew. We know they tell of the future that is, the future that was, and the future that is yet to come. The Zeros? We failed at modifying the line. We failed at adding a single dot. It was clear. We were to be messengers at best. But messengers to whom? To you. We removed our ability to read those stories from your original template. A doorway that is also a puzzle. We must find the solution. Those were Brutus's words when he visited the vault under the Colosseum more than 2,000 years ago. He drew the vault, sketched it to the best of his abilities, but he could not see. Just as you are blind, you may read your watch, you may read hourglasses and calendars, but you cannot grasp beyond that simplistic surface. For now, the true reading of time still escapes you. And so today, the curtains pulled and the Eros is shown, tragic and complete. Those walls you might never read. Events yet unfold as written. But something, anything must change. You do not understand what is at stake. The reader has no power. He is but an observer. But the author? The author invents the future. Okay then. Okay, this was kind of creepy. I don't actually know what's going on. But I'm just gonna press on. Wait. Do I... Wait, I don't have to listen to that. Wait, what else have I got to listen to? There is... Yeah, some silica right here. Wait, did I miss this? Hmm. Alisa drew these symbols here. Was she trying to figure out their meaning? Oh, there we go. I think I know what Dark Deeds Haliset was after here. Haliset was doing a ritual. She began by calling to Osiris with these offerings. She used a knife to sacrifice her captives. She collected their blood for some dark purpose. She was attempting to learn these strange symbols. She must have found them in this room. Once she knew the symbols, she carved them here. And ended the ritual with one final prayer over the sarcophagus. Alicet must be trying to bring someone back to life. But just who is buried down here? The child. My child! You lost your child. I haven't. Her rest is temporary. You have intervened on her reawakening. And yet you aligned yourself to the Order. Ravage this tomb. Halicet! Don't you dare say my name! My name does not merit your lips, you who have dishonored her. 
I am a good mother. You are no match for me, desert scum! Damn, she so she just played the same trick on me that I play on like every other enemy in this game. Well freaking done. I have no idea what this place is or what that narrator was talking about, but uh, I think I want to get out of here, like right fast. And as I thought, she's a master hunter. Oh god, not the darkness. Anything but the darkness. You are no different than any of the others who have come before you. Oi! No. Anything come. but fire. Fight me if you must. Then your blood will be part of my daughter's resurrection. I will bury you in the sand. Um... This is certainly an interesting way to fight. Right, here we go. It's picking up. Not good. No, it's really not good because that usually means sandstorm. Now I will show you what happens to those who desecrate my daughter's tomb. Yeah! Will you stop using that? S oh, whoa, okay. This is a proper boss fight right here. Um, how exactly does this boss fight work? You know what? Stuff the fire arrows. I can pretty much dodge them. For a master hunter, she is a horrible shot. Protect me from this defiler. I have come only for you, hyena. The gods need not be involved. You have infringed upon Ije's place of rest, trespasser. The gods are already involved. And so you will find the same fate as all other trespassers. Death by my hand! You are in pursuit of the impossible, Haliset. No measure of magic can bring our children back. Where'd she go? Um, hey, what the? Will you stop firing those goddamn arrows at me? Best keep my mouth closed. By just worry about killing her. And, you know, you should keep your mouth closed by, you know, default. I have no idea where I'm going at the moment. My child, where have you come back? The who came before. Only the gods came before. Stop ah! Get off! It is their gift. A level 26 hyena. God damn. Oh god, where is she? Where? Oh, there she is right there. There we go. God damn it. You cannot defeat me, Medjay! Come and face me! Where is she now? Hello? Oh, there's the arrow. She's over there. I like this fight, by the way. This is something different. My heart bleeds without my Ishe by my side. Be thankful. Your blood will help bring her back. Your daughter is dead, Haliset. Nothing will return her. Nothing can. I will save my daughter no matter the cost! Enough of your pointless words! Then heed my weapon instead, hyena! <laughs> this is who they send after me? The bugs on my beasts are fearsome! You would be best to give yourself up, Halicent. I know your pain! You know nothing of my pain! No child would want this from their parents, hyena! Do not speak of what my child wants! Got her! 
You can run, but you can't hide. Do I walk among the dead now? A just end. You defiled the dead and enabled the people who killed my son. All on a selfish whim. No. I gathered the silica for them. It powered the magic stone of those who came before. You saw it, didn't you? These symbols only needed to be learned. It is not meant for us. It makes no difference now. I wanted to protect my daughter in life and death. I have done neither. Osiris! Please grant me reunion. She walks alone in the field of reeds. Am I to remain in the Duat Laeva? I just want my daughter back! have done it. The hyena is dead. May you find your daughter in the afterlife, Haliset. May the Lord of the Duat guide you. Okay then. Now that was an ending right there. So, we've still got some time to uh, figuratively and literally kill. So, I reckon... Uh, we've still got two tombs to uh, have a look at. Plus, we've got a a sink point to look at. So, sure, the last two things we'll do today is we'll go have a look at these other two pyramids. Plus, I want to climb this pyramid. Because, you know, what? Hello? Are you a ghost? Um, hello? Buddy? You okay there? Uh, what the living hell is going on? Okay, that's just a regular guy. Now, how exactly do I make it up here? Do I just have to do one furious climb? By the looks of it, yes. Okay, this may actually take a while. Although I am actually going up pretty fast. No, no, no. Get you. And now go up a little bit, and then up a little bit. Don't fall off, I will be angry. Are we halfway up at least? Oh yeah, oh, we're a little bit more than halfway up. Just keep on climbing. And eventually we will reach the top. I think we're almost at the top. I'm only 30... No! Grab something. God damn it, I just slid down another 10 meters. Come on, bike. Don't be a pain in the ass. Do it. Do it. Come on, free little things. Come on. Yes, there we go. And look at that view. And by the looks of it, there's more pyramids down south. Slide down the pyramid. Go on. Who wouldn't? What fool would set up camp out here? I should have a look. Wait. Sets up camp? What are you talking about? Wait, what? Oh! There's another quest in here. Okay, but I guess we'll leave that till next time. I just want to continue sliding down this. No, Bayek, you're ruining it. There we go, I slid down a pyramid. 
So, we've got two more pyramids to go through. The next one is this big, massive-looking thing over here. Go don't know who this belongs to, but sure, let's go have a go at it. This is another massive, massive pyramid. Now I just have to get up into the thing. Shouldn't be too much trouble. Right, who is this? Uh, the tomb of... Kafri? Kafre? So we've got another stone tablet to go find, so... Might as well do these now. This just speed things along. Anything back there? Oh, there's two ways to get into this. Okay, let's go this way first. I can always return here if need be. There's some more silica. Okay, that's just something to read. Pause that if you want to read it. There's nothing up here, so the way down must be down... down here. And, yep, light that bad boy up. I'm pretty sure you need silica for something involving crafting. Those who desecrate your bedchamber shall not enter the reed fields. Okay, let's not, you know, moderately desecrate anything. There's also a hidden chamber here. Lovely. Light these things up as we go through, just in case we have to return. Oh, what have we... Whoa, what is this? Levers are affected by the weight of objects placed on each side of the lever. Uh... Oh, shit. Sorry! I'm desecrating stuff that I probably shouldn't be touching. Levers, you say? Uh, does this count? Have we got any... Let's not touch these. Although I think I already may have done it already. Whoops. Lord of the Blood Seas, may you raise these arms against those who oppose you in the afterlife. That doesn't sound nice. Yes, there we go. Oh, what's this over here? Now I'm curious. Really curious. Wait, does this count as defiling? I'm pretty sure looting counts as defiling. Just quickly light these two things up here. Oh, I think we've found our stone tablet. We must be done. Oh, that's a new rare shield. I will take that. Ancient writing from the Old Kingdom. All right, beautiful. <laughs> so, we should have one more... We should have one more pyramid to go look inside of. Which I might as well do today, since we got the hyena completed so quickly. And there we are. Daylight. Wow, that's uh, that was a tomb and a half. So, we've got one more pyramid to explore, and I'll do those side missions next time. No, I keep doing that. 
We just gotta go here. I see you. What the? What the living hell is this? Huh? What is this? Are these bandits? Go away and leave me alone. Yeah, don't mess with this horse, buddy. It will mess your day up. Right, so there's just a bunch of random bandits waiting to ambush you, is there? Well, that's kind of dickish and incredibly trollish. So here's our last pyramid that we have in Giza. Which pyramid does this belong to? I don't know how to say that name either. But you know what? I will run into a tomb not knowing what's in here. There could be snakes for all I know. This one seems a little bit different. It seems more well stocked. There's a gateway to hell there. And there's a doorway to hell here. Oh, hello. We've already found something. Okay. But this is not the main objective. There is another route there I could take. Is there anything else around here? No. And there's a section down here. What the hell? That sounded like a lot... There is a lot of loot up there. Yeah, I could have figured there'd be a snake. Goddamn snakes. Right, so this obviously isn't the... Hold on a second. Where am I supposed to go then? Because that just led around in one giant circle. Aha! Here we go. Little secret entrance up top. Uh, okay. No, Bayek, wrong thing. There we go. Ah, and here's our stone tablet. Okay, this one was an actual small one. Oh my god, that is actually quite a large name. I'm just going to let anybody else read that if they want to pause it. This is the Savron shower chamber of whoever that guy is. For when his car returns to speak with the mortal world, we will see how greatly we loved him. Okay. Ancient writing from the old kingdom. Gotcha. Well, this tomb's now complete. Well then. So, there's our three pyramids explored. We've done the big one as part of a main mission. We did this one and then we did the smaller one. So, this is where I'm going to leave this video off for today. Next time, we are going to do the two side quests that are here. There was one up here when I first started, and then I found this one here. So, as soon as after we finish Giza, I'm going to head straight into this area and see if there's anything worth of note. And if there isn't, we'll head straight down into Memphis and start the next load of quests. So... We've got the hyena. So we're going after the lizard next. And I can upgrade my stabilizer glove. 
So that's increased it. I have bought the perk so I can buy ingredients for this now, but there's no shops in Giza, quite oddly. I've got four ability points, and yeah, that's just the drawing that's in there. So ability points. I can go with some stuff. Smoke damp, knock to the ground, I think I will use. And I will take a berserk. There we go. Drop a like, leave a comment, and I will see you all in the next video.